What's up good people, this is Kenya Fan TV for you and as always we are in the streets of Nairobi. Manchester United have beaten Southampton by a margin of three goals. Finally, Marcus Rashford has scored. What do you make of that performance? That performance was amazing from Marcus Rashford. Yeah. If, uh, it was a very pretty game for him yeah. because he stayed a very long period of time before scoring. Yeah. The, other, the, other, the other time Marcus Rashford scored was last season yeah. and season you expect the great Marcus Rashford to score more goals. Honestly, Rashford has been down of late yeah. if you watch football closely. Yeah. And I think he'll catch up. He's not good, but he will catch up. Yeah. I prefer Ganacho to Rashford though. Uh, the performance was very good. Uh, uh, as people are saying, yeah. we have just started our season. Yeah. The season is starting today. Yeah. So we are very much happy and we hope that the season will continue being a good season for us. Uh, I watched that game and Manchester is playing nonsense. You, yeah. you guys should be serious. How, yeah. how do you have... Uh, re ten, car, uh, ten men. Yeah, yeah, ten men. You are playing with ten men and you yeah. still can't score. So you are not serious. Just be serious and play. If you want to play, play. Yeah. Don't, don't just be there seated and you are, you are waiting for salaries. Marcus Rashford, as you all say, know he's a star boy yeah Marcus Rashford has always been a star boy yeah and will never be stop being a star boy yeah. so some people are saying that Marcus Rashford is dead but Marcus Rashford today yeah. has shown people that even if they said he has he was dead now yeah. he has resurrected yeah. I think they have they have win but uh, the game they are too down yeah. because uh, like Southampton they have been given a red card yeah. but there was no more improvement yeah. So the team is still down. Yeah. How much uh, did Manchester United need that victory? Pretty much really because mm -hmm. Manchester has been down of late mm -hmm. and uh, it's a nice comeback for us. Yeah. That victory, uh, I can see it is something that uh, yeah. it is an improvement yeah. since we have lost so many past matches. Yeah. But uh, Marcus Rashford scoring goal, Onana saving yeah. us. I see it is a very good improvement. As a team, I think we are going. We are going somewhere. I think today's match was so impressive. Yeah. Rashford scoring, yeah. even though he hasn't scored in a while, yeah. but I think he's improving, yeah. and we'll be expecting him yeah. shining through this season. Uh, maybe what do you have to say about Andre Onana uh, silencing off the critics without a penalty save? Silencing all the critics. I think his trouble uh, when he was in Uganda yeah. and he was meeting a lot of fans. Yeah. So he was to be greeted in short but yeah. that greeting entails that to, today we have seen Onana himself saving yeah. huge um, uh, a very great penalty, uh, penalty yeah. and that's what Onana is made for. Onana what you should know has glue on his gloves yeah. so Onana will be made to be the best goalkeeper yeah. and Onana will never disappoint us. Uh, Onana is good yeah. he who is watching football Onana is good it's just that he doesn't have like the rightful players because I love his deliveries. I love Onana because he's a good goalkeeper. It's just that you people are hating so much, but he's really a good one. We've also seen uh, Manuel Lugate making his debut today. How crucial is that uh, particular signing, considering we've seen uh, what uh, Casemiro did against Liverpool? Uh, not talk about Casemiro because yeah. that was just an argument they had with the, with the manager. But yeah. we have seen that today he has been in clear shape. Yeah. The new signing that we have, the midfield, the minor, the afraid, and now some game in between, controlling the huge, uh, huge field with all players and maneuvering each round, with, taking the wing, yeah. the, le the left wing and the right, right wing with Marcus Rashford and yeah. that's a pretty awesome performance from them. Mm. Yeah, honestly, yeah. that was like a smart, yeah. smart um, signing, signing. Yeah. and I think it's going to build the midfield better because yeah. if you look at the chemistry of Casemiro, yeah. Bruno and then him, he comes in, yeah. the midfield will be with, with um, some type of chemistry. I think Manuel Gatte coming into the midfield yeah. is a great impact to our yeah. team yeah. since he'll yeah. be covering yeah. Ca Casemiro's part. Yeah. Yeah? And yeah. I think there will be no mistakes again yeah. considering our, his debut yeah. was impressive today. We've seen the likes of uh, Matthias Delit and also Martinez being withdrawn uh, from what seems like an injury. Last season, uh, Eric Tehan complained about uh, most of your defenders being injured. Do you think this is a concern as a Manchester United fan? Yeah, it's a, it's a huge concern, but you know, we have, we have options. Yeah. Nowadays, uh, this season, we have already purchased a lot of defensive. That's why you see that Onana has less work to do. Yeah. And even if they are withdrawn, it won't take a long time. And also, we have a lot of options. I think... Uh, Delight was a very expensive transfer from Bayern Munich and 
yeah. the guy is capable of scoring more goals. Yeah. The, go the goal that he has scored against uh, Southampton yeah. is what we expected fr yeah. from him. And uh, as far as, uh, as Glaze is concerned, the defense team is, uh, is in perfect pitch. Yeah. We have seen Maguire's injury, but uh, that won't bother a lot uh, from the side. He return back to training and we expect much from him also. Well, well, well that is it. This is Kenya Fan TV for you. Remember, these were sports news and fan action lives. Keep on liking, sharing and subscribing for more of these sports videos.